Hi dear friends, it's still the 7th of March 2022, 4.37 local time. This is Euro Aussie on a day chart 1.479. And again, look at this, I've shown it before. We have a massive accumulation of dumb money buyers, a squeeze move as response, boom. The smart money algos pushed Euro Aussie down against the dumb money buyers, taking them out, taking the stops. Okay, in these situations you can enter expensively into the market it's a bit against human nature to sell at those prices when the market already came down but if you have access to the market causality you can do it because you see that we have an ongoing squeeze and dummy bias which you know keep on trying to average down trying to pick up a good price so you can trade against that market structure and make pips even though your own entry is expensive yeah and by the way, I should actually use this opportunity to explain you also the input pairs. Look at that, Euro, Dollar and uh, Australian Dollar. So why are they not correlated for once? Normally Euro, Dollar and Euro, Aussie Dollar are correlated. But look at this, Euro, Dollar went down recently on the day chart and Aussie went up. Why? Here's your answer. Longies were in Euro, Dollar, so Euro, Dollar went down. But in Aussie, there were shorties, red bars. So it went up, you see. And now can you see how this match that uh, while those two changed the correlation on the euro aussie market structure we also have longies so it matches the damani allocation of the other two pairs you understand that's how the markets are correlated if there would have been longies also in aussie aussie would have also gone down and you know have correlation with euro dollar as simple as that that's how forex works guys